What is up you guys? It's your girl Nicole Faye and welcome back to another video. As you guys can see by the title, we are trying viral products from TikTok shop, okay? If you are not living under a rock and you like to scroll on TikTok every single day, then I am sure you have seen... Why ain't nobody tell me my shower? I have no clue why I am so weirdly uncomfortable with my shower being open while I'm filming. I just don't know why. I just, it's just, it's a pet peeve of mine. I like it to be closed, okay? <laughs> Sorry about that. Back to what I was saying. I have brought six products off of TikTok shop, okay? Because TikTok shop has completely took over my for you, all right? A lot of people do not like TikTok shop. I personally don't mind it because I might be a shopaholic, you know? But I don't mind it. And like I said, these products that I have right now are products that I've been dying to try. I was supposed to have seven products that I was supposed to show you guys. It was supposed to be like this. I bought this viral toothpaste off TikTok shop that's like purple and it's supposed to like instantly whiten your teeth. Like I really fucking need it because my teeth are like yellow. Anyway, I don't want to make you throw up. Anyway, um, I really want to try the product, but it's it's taking forever to get here. Like it's still in transit back in LA and it's like not here yet. So I'm like, I'm not going to keep waiting on this purple viral toothpaste that might not work that I paid $20 for. And if it doesn't get here by this weekend, I want my money back. Okay. But anyway, yes. Yeah, so I only have six products to show you guys. And I'm really excited to try these products because these products went like viral viral like over a million viral all right okay so the first product we are trying from tiktok shop is from a brand called eye shine cosmetics these are individual lashes i'm gonna have the video up right here of like where i got the product from and the video i saw that inspired me to buy it but yes these are individual lashes now i've done something like this before if you ever heard of the kiss falsies that you can get in target those are another like really pretty individual lash set that you can get but the thing about these lashes is they don't go on top of your lash they go under to make them look natural and by looking at this girl's video her lashes at the end of this video were absolutely gorgeous so I was like I definitely have to grab these because they look like a professional did it they look like professional meat lashes I have the whole kit I have the lashes I have the bond and seal I also have the remover because that is important okay let me tell you something if you do not have the remover that goes with these individual lash sets you're not gonna be able to get them off I mean you could probably try with like coconut oil to get them off but you need the remover or they are not coming off and then i also have the utensil as well to put them on so let's try these out because my lashes i want my lashes to look like hers in the video because her shit was nice okay i paid 27 dollars for the lashes and then the kit came separately and for the kit i paid 38 dollars. so this shit was not cheap all right this was not cheap Hopefully, you know, these don't come off in a day because this was not cheap. Okay, let's get started. So I already went and just like washed my eye because it says how to apply. First prep the lashes, wash with oil-free soap to remove the natural oil. So I just got like hella soap in my eye, washing my eye. But anyway, brush a light coat of the bond on the base of the natural lashes goes a long way. So we're gonna go and use the bond. Okay, so I had to grab my little mini camp, <laughs> little mini mirror so I can see exactly what I'm doing. So now I'm just taking taking the bond and I'm just going to, why is it curled like that though? I don't know if you guys can see how curled it is. <laughs> what the f Suspicious, very suspicious. Okay, so we're just, we're just gonna put this on our lash. I'm just going to coat them. Ooh, this is scary. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm trying not to poke myself in the eye. Okay. I have the bond on. Who Lord Jesus Christ take the wheel. So now it's time to add the lashes now that since I put the bond on. Look how pretty they are. Wow, they even have like the length in like centimeters, like how, I mean in millimeters how long they are. I feel like a lash tech, okay? Come get your lashes done. It says start from the outer corner and work your way to the inner corner. So maybe I'll like zoom you guys in like a little bit more so you guys can like really see. So we're gonna do long, like really long in the outer corner. I'm not gonna do 18 cause that's gonna be too long. I like mine to be like dainty and short. So I'm just gonna do 16, which is right here. I'm gonna take 16 and put it on the out, the outside. I'm just gonna put it directly under. <gasps> it's cute. Wow, looking good already. <laughs> Oh, keeps getting stuck. Okay, I'm gonna do one more 16. Oh, 
Okay, let me back you guys up a little bit or let me zoom you guys in. Do you guys see how beautiful this is? Did I go to professional? No, I did it myself. I love like a really pretty cat eye. This looks gorgeous. Now I'm gonna put the sealant on so it won't be like sticky and your eye won't like f open. So you can blink and your eye opens. That's what I mean. Okay, so after you're done like applying the sealants, you're just going to take your little thingy thingy and clamp them so they like don't come off. Oh, it's stuck. No. Okay, I almost saw God a little bit too early, okay? that was It was, it was almost over with for my eye because I didn't think I was going to come back from that. And now since like I feel like I kind of messed it up because this thing got stuck, now it looks like really clumpy on this side, but whatever. I'm just going to do the other eye off camera and then come back and let you guys know my opinion. Five minutes later. Okay, so I'm finally done with the other side. I'm going to zoom you guys in a little bit more. Come on, zoom work. So you guys can like see how it looks. Here it is. They look absolutely gorgeous. They look so pretty and natural. This side is still kind of messed up. I don't know if you guys can tell, but because I clamped it way too early before it was dry and it got stuck like that, I almost lost my life. It's like really like stuck together over here, but it's okay. We're gonna keep the show going, but I absolutely love how they turned out. This is really gorgeous, okay? The only thing that I do not care for, and oh, before I even give that opinion, I wanna give you guys the sizes I did. So I did like three 16s, two 14s, and one 12. So I did like 16 on the outer, 14 in the middle, and then 12 on the end to give it like a really like cat eye, cause I like a cat eye look. But I absolutely love how they came out. All I have to say is, it's not mm -hmm. worth $60, okay? They have some just like these that are just as pretty and that are just as good and great quality at Target for like $20. I absolutely love how these came out. I just don't like the price. Okay, moving on. So the next product I got is this Pump and Plow. This is a viral, this is by the brand called Beauty Creations. This is their Pump and Plow, Pump and Pout. <laughs> lip boosting, limp pupping booster lip gloss, okay? This is this viral lip gloss that I found on TikTok that like makes like, it's almost like in, like it's injectables in your lips without getting their surgery, okay? Even though, you know, I have some juicy lips already and I really don't need this, I just wanted to try it, okay? Because people's limps was like this, okay? It was giving, it was giving. And as you guys can see in the video, the girl's lips look absolutely gorgeous. Like it looks so nice. And this is actually not a product that just came out. This product has been out for like a year already now and I'm just finding out about it. So I really wanna try this to see how this is already gonna do my already juicy lips. And I think it's also really cute that it comes in like a syringe. Like that is just like so creative. Like how you have to like pump it out like a syringe on your lip. If I can pump it, come on. It won't do it. Oh my, is, did I get a, a broke one? How do I do this? I fixed it. So you just like pump it out like a syringe on your lips. So cute. Come on, if any comes out, what the f Please don't say mine's is broke. Oh, there we go. And I think I got the color, I got mine's in the color So Unbothered. It's like a cocoa brown one. So let's see how this looks and how this is going to pump my lips. Hopefully this is moisturizing because my lips is dry as hell. Okay, ooh, the color is like really pretty. It smells good too. Okay, I can already feel my lips tingling, but I absolutely love the color on me. I'm always scared to do like a nude like lip gloss or a nude lip because I feel like it'll look crazy with my skin complexion, but this is actually pretty. But this shit is tingling, okay? Oh Jesus, this shit is tingling like crazy, okay? But the color is really pretty. Oh, this is tingling though. All right, so I'm just gonna wait a little bit more minutes to see if like it's gonna really like flare up my lips, but I do feel it, you know? I, I feel it, I do feel it. So I'll be right back few moments later. Okay, so I have had the limp pumper on for about three or four minutes now, and this is what my lips is giving. It looks really good. I could definitely see just a tad difference on how it pumped my lips, and it feels nice. Like the tingling is 
subtle. It's not like a crazy tingle that's gonna like make you uncomfortable. It's a really subtle tingle. Except for in the beginning, it kind of burned a little bit. But now it's like calmed down. It's completely like really subtle and it looks really nice. And I absolutely love the color. I've had a really bad experience with lip pumpers in the past. So I'm really shocked that this one does not have my lips like infected and red and huge. Cause that's usually how lip pumpers have my lips. That's not normal. That's why I don't really, I don't really f lip pumpers. But I like this one. I got this one for six dollars off a of TikTok shop and I absolutely love the color. This is the color so unbothered. This one is really pretty. I just noticed that my shower curtain was kind of halfway open when I was doing those videos. I forgot to close it after washing my eye. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next product. So now we're going with the viral. This is the Kimchi Pearl Gone Wild Illuminator. I have been seeing the Kimchi products all over my For You and everyone raves about the setting powder. I tried my best to get my hands on the Kimchi setting powder, but that was completely sold out. So I tried the Illuminator. I always saw this girl like putting it on her face and it looks really pretty. I don't really use like illuminators as much as I used to anymore, but I'm, I wanted to try kimchi products. So I just bought this one because this was literally the only one available. Can we just give a round of applause for how glowy this is? This is going to blind somebody. Okay, so we're just gonna try just a little on my cheek area, but before we even do that, I wanna give the price of how much this is. This is in the color Hope, and I paid $25 on TikTok shop for this little Illuminator, Illuminator highlighter, okay? This shit better have me shining bright like a diamond for $25, but we're gonna try it and see if it does. Okay, I'm gonna just take a little brush and we're just gonna see how this is gonna have me looking. This looks really pretty though. It's kind of hard to pick up. Okay, I got a lot on my brush. So I'm just gonna put some right here on my cheek. I don't have on any makeup, so this is just bare skin I'm gonna put it on. <gasps> what? This shit is bright. Oh my gosh, okay. Let's do some on this side. Oh, wow. This is really pretty. Do you see that? Do you? Do, tell Rihanna to call me, okay? Because what the f***? This is gorgeous. <gasps> Stop. This is so pretty. I'm going to put some under my brow. <gasps> this is absolutely gorgeous. Yes. It's really subtle, too. It's not like a lot. I also love how, like, extremely subtle it is. Like, when you look in the mirror, it does not look on... It does not... Well... No, it looks good. I could definitely see me using this and I don't even use highlighters anymore, but I really like this. Okay, $25 is wild, but I really like it. So I don't feel like beating myself up over paying $25 for a highlighter because this is really pretty. Shut up and take my money. Okay, so the fourth product, we are done with all the makeup. Those are basically all the things I've bought off a of TikTok shop that was like beauty wise. Now it's time for candy. A little fun fact about me, I absolutely love candies and that's why I have three cavities. Yeah. So I bought this candy from a business called Candy Boulevard LLC on TikTok. They are absolutely huge on TikTok for like making like chamoy pickle can, eating the chamoy pickle and putting like the fruit roll up and candy on it or like freezing like candy in a freezer and eating it. Like they're really big for doing that. So I bought some chamoy gushers and these sour pickle balls that I've been wanting to try. I'm really nervous about this one, but I'm really excited to try these chamoy pickles. Like I am I am a huge fan of just watching people eat. Not a huge fan, but I like to watch people eat on social media, especially candy. I've tried the chamoy pickle before and like put like the tonkies and like the different, like the tauhine and stuff, the different stuff you put on the chamoy pickle and it was really good. So I'm really excited to try these gushers. Oh, they smell so good. Okay, here we go. Come on. Of course they're sticky, but they're like stuck sticky. Okay, can't even get it out. Mm. Mmm, this is really good. Who would ever guess that chamoy would taste so good on gushers? Now, the only thing I'm gonna say is my mouth is hot, but it's good. Okay, now we're gonna try the sour pickle balls. I'm a little scared. Everybody that I have seen try these almost went into a heart attack by how sour these are. What am I doing with my life? And I can't even like pull up how much I paid for these because for some reason my TikTok is like tripping. But anyway, here we go. Oh, it smells like death. Oh, it looks disgusting. Disgusting! Okay, here we go. Fuck. 
Huh? Mm. Ooh. The things I do for views. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Oh my gosh. Give me a second. That was absolutely disgusting. Look at my tongue. <gasps> no! It wasn't even that sour. It was just nasty and it's hot. This is disgusting. This is absolutely disgusting. Never again. Ugh. I have this like nasty aftertaste and my stomach hurts. I just like the chomoy candy, not the sour pickleball. Absolutely not. <sighs> I just had to take like an hour break to get myself together. I tried my best to like get all that green shit out of my mouth and stuff by brushing my teeth and like taking hella mouth washing my mouth and like trying to get all the green stuff out of my mouth. That toothpaste that I ordered on TikTok shop would have came in handy right about now, right? If it really worked to get my teeth whitened. My teeth are green. Still, anyway, we're just gonna move on to the next product. My stomach hurts and this next product is probably gonna make my stomach even worse. But we're gonna try it anyway. The next product that I have is these viral take a shot straws. I have been seeing these all over. And one thing about me, I love taking a shot, okay? But I hate how taking a, a shot tastes. This is a take a shot straw that you are supposed to put liquor in and drink some juice in, like drink some juice in it. And you're not supposed to taste the liquor anymore. Like this shot is supposed to make the taste of liquor go away. This should be illegal. Let's be for real here. This is not a shot. This is a whole drink, but we're gonna do it anyway. I got some tequila sitting over here. A lot of people were taking it with like some really nasty tequila. I don't know what the tequila is called, but I can't wait. Can you even show liquor on YouTube? You didn't see that. You didn't see that. Anyway, I'm gonna take a shot with this stuff, with this tequila I have, and then I just have like this watermelon juice. So I paid $20 for this shot, and I already put it in like the dishwasher from the young lady's video that I just played. She said to put it in the dishwasher first to really get like, I guess the end of it really loose so you're able to like really suck it, I don't know. But basically we're just gonna pour the liquor in here and let's see if this works, okay? I am really excited to try this, especially after having that horrible experience with that pickleball shit. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's liquor. Maybe I should do this over the sink, I'll be right back. Few moments later. Okay, so I've just put all of the liquor that can fit in here. Now it's time to drink it. So basically you just like push up the straw and you take your juice and you just drink it. Wait, maybe I should get like this so like you guys can see that I'm actually drinking it. Okay, here we go. Okay. Nothing's coming up. Okay, come on. It's not working. What am I doing wrong? It's, it's not working. <laughs> I'm a idiot. I still had the cap on it. That that's that's why it wasn't working. Okay, here we go. Oh. Okay, I like this. This was definitely worth $20. So I tasted the liquor just a little bit, like when you're trying to get the juice to come up. But once you get the juice up and you flip it up, you cannot taste the liquor anymore. All you taste is straight juice. This is dangerous, but this shit works, okay? I am so glad I got this product. The hype is real and definitely check this out if you like the drink. Okay, so for the last and final product that I bought off a of TikTok shop that is just absolutely insane. And when I saw this video of this girl using it, I was just like, I have to buy that even though this is very weird. It is a bloody tampon in the form of a bath bomb. You heard me. It's a bloody tampon in the form of a bath bomb and it even has the string. What is wrong with you people? What is wrong with me for buying this? When I went to on TikTok shop to look up how much I purchased for this product, I bought this product a while ago, like back in June. She stopped selling these products. Like she stopped making them and she stopped selling them. This is so weird, but this shit smells so good. When I took this stuff out the packaging, which I just took it out today because I've been saving it for a while, this stuff smells so good and I have no clue why I haven't used it yet because I always knew that I want to do like a video of just like buying random stuff on TikTok so I, I knew I had to save this but this is crazy like did you guys see that lady's bath water like her wet bath water was so 
glittery it just like it just looked really really nice now i'm not a fan of using like bath bombs i don't use bath bombs a lot because i don't like to use like a lot of fragrance or too much stuff in my bath water but sometimes i like to get a little disobedient and use like a bath bomb so i tried this one the bad thing about it though we cannot try this on camera like me actually getting in the tub because not only i can't show you guys you know me being naked but um my bathroom's not clean okay it's not filthy like not disgusting filthy but it's just not clean enough and not appropriate enough for me to show you know what i'm saying so just trust my word that this stuff smells good and this is just another weird product i bought off a tiktok shop and that is pretty much a wrap of today's video of viral things i bought off a tiktok shop definitely let me know you guys in the comments if you guys have ever tried any of these products one thing i could say my favorite products of trying today was definitely the lashes i love the lip gloss and the viral shot straw those are my three favorite products i tried from this little video today i absolutely am going to be using those every single day okay because my lashes are on fleek thank you guys so much for watching today's video definitely let me know in the comments if you guys have ever purchased anything off a tiktok shop or if you guys have ever used any of these products that i've showed you guys today i love you guys so much don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys next video